Welcome everybody. Um, we're just going to run through this quick video of how to use um, the TomTom Tom website and loading up your GPX files so you can use them on my drive and your TomTom Tom Go either on your mobile phone or on your sat nav device. Uh, first thing you're going to get to this screen as you open the web page um, and you're going to just need to click the sign in button there. Um, this is going to bring you up into a login thing. So if you haven't got an account, you're going to click, click on create account. You're going to go through the details. Um, we're just going to cancel back out of that because we actually have an account. So we're just going to log into that already and show you where it goes from there. So you'd have set up your account, you'd logged in. Um, now there's something strange about this. So when you click up here in the three bars, you're going to get your TomTom Tom and it's going to come up with my items. If you click on this, TomTom is Tom set up in a strange way so that you can't actually do anything. So what we need to do, just cancel that a little second. So we're just going to click anywhere on the map. All right, it's going to bring up this A32. What we're going to do is we're going to click on the star. Oh, let's try again. We're on the wrong spot. We're going to click on the star. It's going to ask us to save that as a location. It's going to save it as a favorite. Um, so we're just going to click save. All right, we've got save to places. All right, now we're just going to cancel out of that. We're going to click off of there. So we go back to the three bars now. If we go into my items, now in our places, we can see that we've got that A32 Wickham there now. So what we're going to do now is go on to routes. And now we've got this import GPX file box, which is what we really wanted. So once we click on that, bring up our list of um, routes, we'll go to your file there, you want your routes. So you're gonna click on that first file and you're gonna go upload. Now, again, TomTom is a little peculiar because it gives you two options, uh, two, two versions of the same file. So all we're gonna do is we wanna get rid of this Portsmouth Driving Test Center route, the fast one. So we're gonna click on the three dots and we're gonna delete that. So that's gone now. All right, clear that off the screen. Then we're gonna click on Portsmouth Driving Test Center route, the exact file. Here we go. And then it brings up the route there. And all we need to do at this point is sync this route as a track to my device. So I click on that. You can see it says route synced. So that'll push that through to your My Drive uh, app on your mobile phone now. Now, just very simple, go back to your return items. You've got your route there. You can click on import GPX file. You can click on your second route, upload, run through the process again. So delete the fast one, click on the exact, sit, click over to sync it. I'm running through it a little bit fast there. All right, and then return to your items. And you just carry on doing that again and again until you've loaded up all of your routes. Hope that helps.